Hi everyone, this is Vicki and Chuck. Welcome to TLC. Just like every other day, this is the day the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. He gives us every day we have. Thank you so much for being here with us, you all. What a blessing to have you join us each day in this little corner of Father's Vineyard. Just very quickly, I want to let you know again, people are being unsubscribed without their permission. So if you've subscribed to the channel, and you might want to check and make sure you're still subscribed. Thank you guys. I'm going to read a little bit today out of the 119th Psalm. Blessed are those whose way is blameless, who walk in the law of the Lord. Blessed are those who keep his testimonies, who seek him with their whole heart, who also do no wrong, but walk in his ways. You have commanded your precepts to be kept diligently. Oh, that my ways may be steadfast in keeping your statutes. Then I shall not be put to shame, having my eyes fixed on all your commandments. I will praise you with an upright heart when I learn your righteous rules. I will keep your statutes. Do not utterly forsake me. How can a young man keep his way pure? By guarding it according to your word. With my whole heart I seek you. Let me not wander from your commandments. I have stored up your word in my heart that I might not sin against you. Blessed are you, O Lord. Teach me your statutes. With my lips I declare all the rules of your mouth. In the way of your testimonies I delight as much as in all riches. I will meditate on your precepts and fix my eyes on your ways. I will delight in your statutes. I will not forget your word. Father, we thank you for the words you've given us throughout the ages, for your scriptures, for all of those who are faithful to to write them down. Father, for how you have protected your word, we know that the enemy is always trying to destroy the things that you've said. But Almighty God, you're so wise. We not only have scripture, we have the tremendous gift of your Holy Spirit to teach us whatever we need to know. Thank you, Father and to help us rightly divide your word. Thank you, Father. Thank you. 
Father, we stand in agreement in prayer with all of our brothers and sisters in you, asking for the gift of being able to hear you more clearly. We pray for all of those who are lost. Father, they're not lost to you. You know where they are. Just as you knew where Adam was when you called to him in the garden. We ask you, Father, for all of those you want, for all of those you're calling, we pray for them, knowing that they have to make their own decisions about you, but whatever it is that you want us to do or that you will do, that's what we pray for, that you would give us wisdom to know what our part is every day in the lives of those around us. Thank you, Father, for being God. Bless us as we meditate on you. We meditate on your word. Bless us as we sit and think about who you are. Bless us to be able to remember always that you have made us for your glory. Thank you, Father. We pray all things in the name of our Savior, Yeshua HaMashiach, Jesus the Christ, the Word of God, faithful and true. Amen. <laughs>